guys welcome back to the university of texas and el paso series we are in the final week of the regular season where we play one in ten mid tennessee state university we are eight and three nowhere to be found on the polls got locked out of a couple of recruits reallocated those points nothing of significance nobody will probably land with us being late in the season uh we are going for our ninth win here and if we could get this a conference championship and a bowl win we could finish with 11 wins and possibly a rank in the final rankings all right we're getting onto the field in our final regular season game and our final home game and look at this this team is now pretty much selling out home games love to see it when a team succeeds and the fans start to get a little more involved than they were makes it to the 37 the minus obviously you wish they would be involved the from the beginning but no winning winning today. brings You're attendance really up. works like that with pro sports hall sports in from general 37 yard line first down he's gonna try and scramble bam Fires it out. Tackle. The it's gonna be an easy game here it seems like Guys, i really like what the offensive coordinator is doing here throwing it on first and second down Keep the defense guessing. Damn, they sent a lot of heat. At the 47. Wow, that is Pittsburgh upset game. number 11, Miami. That's one of those as an offensive lineman. When the film study starts to come around, you're going to kind of sink in your chair and just hope they don't call you out because you're going to get embarrassed on See if Monday. We can't, on that no, we don't want to run that play again. We'll run this one. He goes out of Got a foot in. A Makes it manageable. What impresses me so much is the guy's vision. He read the coverage perfectly to find his man for good yardage. Third and three. Ball on the 32-yard line. Nice play fake. Makes the Did he get a foot in? Trent Thompson is a monster. Great throw, too. They're a little bit confused on how to handle him. And he's taken down at about the seven yard line. Hankins gets around three on that. He moving. This is the eighth play of this drive. I'm gonna run to the right and see if we can't score here. Oh, push it left. There we go. Found the hole and ran through it. See what we can do here. Defense got a good stop. Right, we're gonna throw it there. Oh, let's pick. The psyche of this defense, but maybe even the conditioning where they start to get a little bit fatigued. That could have been a huge shift in momentum if they were able to hold on to that one. Wow, that was close. So it's second and ten. Ball on the 20 yard line. Texas El Paso up seven points. Nice run there. Gain of six on the draw play. Oh, perfect placement. Good throw. Around the 40 yard line. It's a great job here by the quarterback of recognizing the outside linebacker. Now we're going to try and just throw it deep. Ah, uh, this team is really down. bad. I'm really not worried about them at all. 40 yard line. It's first down. So, like this, it was like boom. Ah! Cohen, we have missed you, my friend. We have missed you, my friend. That route running. Nasty. We appreciate you. We're actually going to run the screen as is. Get up, get up. 
They go with a screen here in the half back. How how he none of those guys blocked him is beyond me. That'll bring up second and eleven. From the forty one yard line. Second Oh, I really hate these quick plays. I guess we'll run this with a running back as a wide receiver. Not ideal, but I guess it'll work. Look at that, McKee. Good play, 23 yards. I've never heard of Forrest McKee before. He's probably wide receiver six. He is white. Play action pass here. We're going to try and hit either Thompson or Cohen on that crosser. It was Thompson when he covered that left left side to cover Cohen. Left him wide. Easy money. Only one incompletion so far. The offense is really just rolling. We're just going to we'll test them, honestly. Now he tries to buy some time. He launches one for the end zone. And this one's broken up. There was definitely an receivers definitely don't play those deep throws very well. But it was just a terrific play by the safety to prevent that touchdown. It's second and ten. We're gonna try this. Out of bowl. Boom. Cohen actually might be a money. Yeah, there's no over top help. Nothing over top. Come on, Cohen. Can't connect. Mm-hmm. Not the quarterback for that throw. That's a. It's definitely more of a power five quarterback throw. But the recruit we got coming in is a power five caliber quarterback. So he very well could make that throw in the future. Mm. Good throw. 16 Oregon. Beat Oregon State in overtime. First and 10. Ball on the 29 yard line. So boom. Carries the ball for a nice Deion Hank is with six yards. Get seven yards on the play. That'll make it second and four. Hank has been a great, great player to have on this team. Especially as this O line develops and gets a little older. Up the middle for gets a little better, hopefully, this next season. Right tackle needs replaced for sure. He gets bullied every other game. He might be one of the younger guys. You never know, though. Perfect throw. Perfect throw to Cooper on the corner pass for an easy touchdown. I think Mid Tennessee might be worse than North Texas, even though they have a win. Their win's probably against North Texas. Take off. Oh, didn't quite get taken off. If this offense keeps running at this guy, they're gonna have to rethink some of their play calling. Let's run. It's second down, 12 this. to go. Ball on the 34 yard line. Rolling out to the right side. Who I had my running back. By the offense. The quarterback's doing everything he can. I had a face itch and couldn't throw it. The problem is <laughs> oh, well. the offensive line did not do a good job protecting him. They're very fortunate that ball wasn't intercepted. See what we can't do here. Man, they are dropping stuff. They suck. It's a good hold by the Now their punt returner will get a chance to make something happen. Things are on the verge. So for anyone who's here because of the FQ Ducks account, you know, anything shared or you follow my account because of it. We are going to change how I run that account. It's gonna be less opinion based content and more just reporting what's going on with oregon football reporting what we know to be true less of you know my opinions that might be stuck to my personal account from their own the skill might be i'll keep the my personal opinions and stuff on there just try and cover oregon the best i can over there in fq ducks for the unbiased fan here's the throne i don't think he got anything on that we are playing distracted this is not working out very well I wonder if I'm gonna actually be able to catch some UTEP games now. Because I would like to. I'm invested in some of these players. That drop. That was a that was an easy touchdown. 
I invested in some of these players the now, like uh, Hankins, absolute monster. These quarterbacks, not so much. Cohen, going to be my favorite player in college outside of the Ducks. But I really think you've got to be man. It's the junior safety. We need to calm down with these throwing for touchdowns and stuff. Good tackle by a quarterback. A well-timed interception there. Well, they're still down by a couple of scores, but the turnover certainly helps their chances. If they score on this drive, back in the game. And the offense will take the field, and they're certainly hoping to do better than they did on their last drive, which ended with a turnover. This quarterback can make good passes. He just needs to focus on not forcing the ball to his receivers. Ah! Makes it out to about the 16. That makes it second and two. So it's second down. Oh shit, hold up. Two yards to go. There's only nine seconds left. It's gonna take their first time out of the half. They'll spread the field here. Let's see what the defense does with a five wide outlook. And he hits Man. it hard at the six yard line. Aggressive call there to send the corner and it paid off. Boy, did he get in there quick or what? Try it again. Try to get some kind of positive play out of it. From their own six yard line. Do a better pass protection. Let's hope they could cover me a little longer. Some of the guys are they sending. Not all that many. Rolls to the right. I'm glad I got that out of my hand. No surprises here as we come to the end of the first half. Nothing. Miners. It's going to be interesting to see a how big the action here. shakes out in this series. Going to play it a little safer, less less insane deep balls, and just go for wide receivers just being better than their DBs. Like that right there. On the move, he throws Great throw by my quarterback, too, on the, the run line. right there. So what do you think of this receiver after that play? The quarterback made a nice throw, but it was the receiver who made this happen. That's a great way to make a statement. From the 49-yard line, first down, five wide. Pop. Cooper's wide. Level him. First down. Brought down right around the 20. Scrambling around. Boom. And they make the stop at the eight yard line. Mm -hmm. It's first down, this. and they'll be looking for six points here. Man, it's intercepted. bad plays. Not only a huge interception to get the football back and maybe have a chance to get back. We really have game. ruined some of our players stats this year by trying to run up scores. See the players and how they're but I'm trying to get promoted. Get a, get a head coaching job somewhere. If I get a head coaching offer, I'm taking it. I need I want to be the head coach. And down he goes. I know we don't want to really leave these players. If I don't get a head coaching offer, I won't leave i'm not gonna leave for an offensive coordinator job but i really want to be the head coach somewhere and we did want to start as an offensive coordinator and we will have left utep in a much better situation than we found them in get to that quickly there we go trent thompson stiff arm keep moving keep moving yeah 44 yard reception the tight end picks up a lot of yardage on that one the big guy isn't the fastest out there but he sure is a load to bring down let's go let's get another play in We'll try and get these guys a conference championship and a bowl win before we try and take a head coaching job. Bah, touchdown. Easy money. Four score lead now. His receivers are making plays. That is a great touchdown. Last drive ended with as good a result as you can hope for, and I'm sure they'd like to replicate that here. Well, I think this defense has got to do something because right now the quarterback is in such a good rhythm that you've got to do something to try. So I do to want to let out. you guys know at about this point in the game, we are going to, to probably sim look, towards the end and uh, just cut out to the results defense. and let you guys see the final score because really this is just a blowout. 
from the 38-yard line. First down, Texas El Paso with a big advantage. Gets it on the pitch. Looking for the corner. Gets to about the 37-yard line. Now he's scrambling. And he might want it all here and does. Interception. And that interception might be what they needed to get back in this ball game. Yeah, nice try, Brad. Keep their hopes up, but I don't think they have a chance of winning this. The offense comes out to start this drive, and they're hoping for a better result as they threw a pick on their last possession. So much in football is about how you respond to adversity. Moving forward after a turnover is a perfect example of that. He's out to the 30. He gets hit out of bounds at the 37. One more quarter to play, and this one appears to be well under control. UTEP's got a three touchdown advantage. It's first and 10. Ball on the 37 yard line. Zipped it out, and that was almost picked off. Thompson, the intended receiver on the play. That makes it second and ten. Welcome back to the action here as we resume play here in quarter number four. Gains his way to the 46-yard line. Unselfish play by the quarterback as the option gives them a nine-yard gain. Throws it to the outside. And it's the senior. Good tackle there in space. From the 24-yard line, it's first down. Side run there. Hankins picks up about seven yards on the run. It's second and goal. About a yard to Pater. This defense not wanting to give an inch here. Touchdown, Utah. I'm not going to lie, I just simmed to the end of the game. Uh, there really wasn't much, much stopping us from running up the score. Uh, Deion Hankins played a great game. Quarterback threw a few picks, obviously. I think next season we're going to try and be more uh, more conservative and be more realistic when it comes to the play call. It. But a 35-7 win to wrap up conference play and uh, secure our spot in the conference championship. I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and I hope to see you next time for the Sun Belt Conference Championship. It should be a fun one. And if you guys like this video, leave a like. And until next time, this is Charger XO signing off.